also want to be very clear today about what I knew about Mr. Prue's death and when I knew it. After our police department responded to the 911 call on March 23rd, I was informed later that day by Chief Singletary that Mr. Prude had an apparent drug overdose while in custody. Chief Singletary never informed me of the actions of his officers to forcibly restrain Mr. Prude. I only learned of those officers' actions on August 4th when Corporation Counsel Tim Curtin reviewed the video while fulfilling the FOIL request from Mr. Prude's attorney. At no time prior to August 4th, the Chief Singletary or anyone make me aware or show me a video of the actions of the RPD officers involved in Mr. Prude's death. I was, I was aware on, May 20, on March 23rd that I was told that Mr. Prude had overdosed and he was being taken to the hospital and that he may die and that it may be investigated because he was in police custody. On March 30th when he passed away, I was notified that he had passed away and that it was being investigated. I was not informed of anything as to Mr. Prude, the Attorney General, the DA, or anything until August 4th when Corporation Counsel notified me and asked me to watch the video. You need to talk to Chief Singletary about what he knew and when he knew it. 